Zano PFMPs have allegedly been sharing their growing disdain for the party with colleagues and opposition citizens coalition for change. CCC organizing secretary Amos Chimaya has claimed. Speaking at the CCC's thank you rally in Gweru following resounding by-election wins on March 26, Chimaya said the ruling party legislators were part of the many who no longer wanted the ruling party to remain in power. His claims follow a deteriorating economic climate that has not spared officials at the Zano PF headquarters. The Zano PF MPs have been telling us that they are not they are tired of their own party. They are no longer wanting it. No one wants Zano PF anymore and this like I am telling you includes their own MPs. Everyone is now fed up with the Zano PF said Chibaya. Even members of the security sector are tired of ZANU PF. They want the party out. President Emerson Mnangagwa is under immense pressure to unite a party whose structures are questioning his capacity to contest against the CCC leader Nelson Chamisa at the 2023 polls. Such sentiments have been aired by members in rural areas, most of which have for long been the ZANU PF strongholds. Our biggest vote is going to come from the rural areas. Those people are tired of ZANU PF declared Chibaya. Mnangagwa's situation has been worsened by a failure to deal with rampant inflation, low wages, indecision on non-performing cabinet ministers, and what those at the party's headquarters feel is a deliberate attempt to shut them out of governance. Civil servants, who constitute a greater fraction of Zimbabwe's employed population, have been forced to to make do with the local currency too, despite their wages losing value on a daily basis.